my mom's ring me work to work today because well first of all last time I tried to get here I literally had like a heart attack that was like two weeks ago I did a loop a good three times I was a half an hour late it was it was not good I was literally screaming crying on the way to work so my mom's dropping me because I don't want to get lost and also I'm going straight to the airport. I was like 15. I, my dad was waiting to talk to me at the Red Cow. And I was actually in Killarney. It was Killarney, wasn't it? Yeah. I was in Killarney. And I was like, I'm going to be five minutes away. I'll be at the Red Cow in five minutes. I got off the bus and I was in Killarney. I got the wrong bus. Directions isn't really my, it's not my strong point. Isn't it not, Mom? No. <laughs> Okay, so this is everything that we've got left to shoot. Another like three more hours. And I'm so tired, but we've got lunch now. So I'm gonna go have my katsu curry. But I'm gonna chill now on this couch and eat my lunch. And then I've got three more hours left. Also, how slow is my makeup? Okay, that does not look too appealing. My mom made the katsu curry. It's not as nice as my katsu. I made it to the airport. My flight was at 8.15, but I was early, so I asked to change to the 7.15. I'm on my way to London. I've got 10 minutes before my flight. I can't believe I'm vlogging in Dublin airport. I need to get 10 minute charge into my phone because I've got no battery. I'm so excited to get to the hotel, order room service, get in the shower, a hotel shower. You can never beat a hotel shower, and you can also never beat a hotel bed. Time for a room tour. I'm staying in this hotel called the Mayfair, and it's called May Mayfair Downtown. The room is really cute. I'm just gonna order some room service now because I'm starving. My stomach is genuinely like begging me for food and grumbling so much. So I'm gonna order some food now. But first, it's time for a little room tour. We walk in, this is the bathroom. We've got a gorgeous little mirror here. A robe, a robe which I cannot wait to get into. A really big shower. And then look at my bed. My bed is so big, like it's huge, but yeah, this is it, it's so cute. Took off all my makeup and that has never felt so good, like that literally feels amazing. I'm going to order some room service and get in the shower and wash my hair. Um, room service please. Could I please order the chicken skewers? Um, could I get the broccoli please? And could I also get some fries please? Okay, thank you, bye bye. Okay, I need to quickly get in the shower and wash my hair before they come. And I'm really hoping that they don't come when I'm in the shower. Sorry, how good does this look? This is really random. I got Parmesan. I thought it was going to be like, as in like Parmesan fries. Got some broccoli and some fries. I was going to get the burger, but it's also like 11 o'clock at night. So the burger was probably a little bit too heavy for this time of night. Not to be dramatic or anything, but this is the definition of my heaven. A big hotel bed to myself, a hotel shower, room service. The latest obsession is tender stem broccoli. It's like my new snack. These chicken skewers, best chicken skewers I've ever had. I have to fill out what I want for breakfast tomorrow, but like, I feel like what I'm in the mood for now, I'm not gonna be in the mood for in the morning, you know? I'm always an apple. Wait, I think I'm between buttermilk pancakes or porridge. Okay, I'm gonna get buttermilk pancakes. But maple syrup. I literally slept like a baby. I would do anything for an extra hour in bed right now. Now when you wake up and you're still so tired, like I know I'm still so tired. So I'm gonna get a red ball or something. Oh my god. This bed is, I think, the biggest bed I've ever slept in in my life. I'm gonna go on. Oh, I'm vlogging. Yeah, I'm going shopping. We're gonna get our little basket and we're gonna shop. I haven't tried these body moisturizers. Yeah, I'm getting a body moisturizer. If you haven't tried these body moisturizers, they're really good. Yeah. This one? Oh, wait, this one's my favorite. So good. For people and communities around the world, share. It's green beauty that works for all of us. Him, her, they. <laughs> and um, I can't believe 18 years is mad. Um, but the changes, that's what's been so
I'm back home in Dublin. We've got my friend's birthday dinner, so we're going to that. There's people looking at me. Oh my god, this is so embarrassing. Oh my god. Yeah, so I was supposed to be on the 6.15 flight, but then I had like an hour. The flight wasn't for like another two hours, so I had either to wait two hours in the airport for my 6.15 flight or 20 minutes to get to my flight. So I changed my flight to the 4.50 flight. Uh, and I'm so happy I did because it's already 7 o'clock. There's no, not a chance I would have made it out if it was, if I got the later one. We got our cocktails. We've actually, we've got a few drinks on the go. We've got our, um, <laughs> what's this called? Vodka. Uh, vodka and soda. And lime. And then we've also got a cocktail. Okay. We made it to Mama Yo. Guys, do you want to say hey to my vlog? I'm vlogging. Oh my god, hey! Friends are so cute! <laughs> Serious, but we're gonna go out tonight. Oh. <laughs> I'm feeling hungover today. We're not thriving today, but I've got ready. I have to go into the Canada Goose Square store and then I'm working with the brand in the Marker Hotel, so I've got that after for some lunch. And then, yeah. And then that's what I'm doing today. But yeah, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not feeling good. Like, I don't know why I was like knocking back drinks at dinner. Like I was downing the wine. Um, so yeah, I've got a headache. Uh, my eyes are sore. Uh, yeah. We're not thriving. In it kind of used at the moment in their dressing room. Their dressing room is so big and the store is really nice. This is the jacket that I think I'm gonna get. It's a pink sleeveless. I don't know if the colour is coming up on this, but it's like so bright pink. It's cute. Pink. I don't know how I feel about this. It's a bucket hat. Well, I don't know. I don't think I can pull off bucket hats. Last time when I talked to you, it was two days ago at the event that I was at and I was really hung over and I don't think I even got much of the event because again I can't vlog in front of people like I actually just can't do it it's just too embarrassing so it's two days later I'm currently going to collect my dress from I think it's called Droby I could be saying that wrong but I'm gonna ask them when I get there how to pronounce to rent a dress because I'm going to London tomorrow and I'm so so unorganized I'm going for two days and I'm like ridiculously unorganized yeah I'm not packed or anything but I'm currently going to collect that dress and then I have to go straight to lunch with my family and then I have to go straight to my brother's match so I'm gonna have to pack tonight and like see what I'm because I have no outfits actually another thing um but I'm so excited for London because the hotel that I'm staying in is like amazing and I'm going to span the hotel and I'm just so excited. The dress that I got is like this blazer pink dress and it's got like feathers on the sleeves, I'm nearly sure. And I'm just praying that it's not too short on me because blazer dresses normally are too short on me because obviously I'm, I'm a tall gal. So yeah, let's just fingers crossed that it's not too short on me because that's not what I need right now. We're at the chop house. We came to the chop house for some drinks and food before my brother's match. And oh, we give a little fit check. So I'm wearing this jacket from my dad's wardrobe. I think it's Boss. Is it? I feel like I saw Boss somewhere. A white t shirt. This is Bevan's white t shirt. And then I got these Levi jeans in Primark. If you haven't gone to see the new like vintage place in Primark, you should. I got like loads of my nice stuff. Beth? Wearing these trousers from Zara, this t shirt from Zara, and this jacket from Zara. Zara. I'm in London. I'm in London with Primark, and I'm. Oh my god, my case is here. I am so excited to be here. I actually feel like crying. This is the nicest hotel I've ever stayed in. Like, the room and the hotel is amazing. When I was checking in, I got champagne. Also, the nicest glass of champagne I've ever had in my life. And yeah, this room is like perfect. Let me give you a room tour. Obviously I need to give you a room tour. Here is the living area. I was left some like chocolate strawberries and cake. There's like 
I'm not sure what that is. But I do a taste test. Oh my god, there's gold on it. There's literally gold on it. Okay, let's do a taste test. Oh my god! Wait, they have my Instagram on. <laughs> Oh my god, they have my Instagram on it. I didn't even see that. Oh, that is so cute. Mmm. They're like protein balls. But I feel like they're not protein balls, but they're like... They're like... Mmm. They're really good. I think I might need to eat the cake as well. Because I'm really, really hungry and I don't know how because I literally had lunch and like two hours ago. Okay, so we've got the living room. Can't believe I missed that. Like, how did I miss that? That is so cute. And then this is the hotel. I can't figure out how to turn on the lights because it's like technology and we all know that's not my strong point. Um, so later on, I'm actually nervous that like I actually will have to be in the darkest. Anyways, that's okay. So we've got my bed. Primark have left me some pajamas. I'm definitely gonna wear this robe. My bathroom. We got a little mirror moment. We've also got a shower and we also have a bath. I don't know if my body's gonna be able to fit in this bath or if my legs could potentially be dangling the end around the edge, but like that's perfectly fine. And we've also got another big mirror. Oh, I can't wait to get into this bath later. I have absolutely no time for this and I should be getting ready for dinner but i'm trying to soak this all in i'm feeling extremely grateful uh to be here so i'm gonna just cut myself a slice of cake let's let's celebrate together this is like victoria sponge cake as well it says welcome miss avo don't know who on it what who do i think i am it's, i'd say this is gonna be the nicest victoria sponge cake ever mm. oh my god I'm literally a bar of chocolate. A bar of chocolate. And I've got a cake saying, welcome Miss Avo Dunahoo. I'm so happy right now. This is amazing. You can call your butler. Like literally, you can, it says a sign, call butler. Okay, I need to get ready for dinner. I definitely shouldn't do this. Oopsies. I had to run and get bobbins because I'm doing my hair in a bun and um, I didn't have any bob bobbins. So I ran upstairs to get bobbins off one of the girls and I came into the room and I just heard hello. But I heard it was like, I thought it was like, I don't know. I don't know why. Oh my God, I'm actually not okay after that. I actually feel like crying. I got such a fright. I just like heard hello, but I thought it was like a speaker in the room. I don't know why I thought like they, they would have like someone on a speaker saying hello when you walk into your room. I just thought it was a speaker and I came in like this I came in like this and then there was just a woman standing there and I was just like oh my god you're giving me such a fright I was like oh my god what the hell are you doing she's like sorry I came to get your bed ready for you for you to go to sleep I was like oh my god I'm so sorry I, I wasn't expecting someone to be in the room I literally like screamed I was like oh my god <laughs> Oh no, that was actually so scary. I'm actually sweating. Like, I actually think there's sweat dripping down me. I'm ready for dinner. Oh my god, obsessed with this blazer. I got it from Joby. It's like a rental place. But, oh my god. I think this is the most stunning dress that I've ever worn in my entire life. And I, oh, I've got mascara on the top of my eye. And I feel like this is just perfect for this hotel vibe. Because this hotel vibe is, this hotel is like the bougiest hotel ever. And everyone downstairs is dressed so nicely. So, yeah. This is perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Yeah. I'm back from dinner. Dinner was amazing. I got a steak, truffle fries. I don't know how I order breakfast here because I'm getting breakfast. I'm not going downstairs for breakfast because I've got no time to go downstairs. So I'm going to order breakfast to the room. But I actually don't know how I do that. I'm going to get into my pajamas and have the best night's sleep ever. Scrub my makeup off. Oh, I can't wait. Okay, I'll see you guys in the morning. can run the bath from this from this thing what the hell 
I need that in my future house. I am so tired. I'm going down to the spa now. Well, I'm going into the spa for 9.30 because my massage is at 10, so I want like 30 minutes in the spa. But I'm trying to decide if I should order breakfast before or after. I have to call my butler. Butler delivered my toothpaste on a tray. Like, in, he delivered it as well in like literally 20 seconds. I was like, that was impressive. Oh my god, it's like a full like wooden toothbrush. I'm going down to the spa now. Oh my god. Oh, oh we love this. It's no plastic, it's all paper. Yes, Lanesborough. Go you. God. I've never seen toothpaste in paper, but we love to see it. I'm gonna use the spa before. I wanna use the sauna. I wanna go. I feel hungover. Like I literally feel hungover. And I actually wish that I could just like lie here for an hour and go to sleep. After that, that was so nice. Look at the spa. It's like the nicest spa I've ever been. I just went into the steam room and I went to the sauna. I was waiting so long on my room service and I was like, what the hell? Like it said it was gonna be here an hour ago. And then I decided to call the butler and I was like, hey, like, I'm still waiting on my food. And I actually ordered it for tomorrow at 12.30. Um, I didn't even, I like, I, how is that even possible? Like, I don't know how I did that. But it just arrived and I got a chicken wrap and some fries. <laughs> You know that song and it's like Can't do well when I think of I have that song on repeat the past hour Just that song The only song on repeat When that song comes on and put it I'm gonna be the happiest girl in the entire world. I'm in the airport. My flight has just got delayed, which is really, really annoying. But I'm just chilling in the lounge. I showed you a little bit of the event, but oh my God, the event was the nicest event I've ever been to in my life. The whole setup, everything, Primark really nailed it to the T. And yeah, we had so much fun. And I'm so sad to be going up. Like I wanted to stay in that hotel forever. I was like not leaving. But yeah, I'm going home now and gonna go straight to bed. I'm so tired, I feel like I need to go get a Red Bull, but it's also like nine o'clock at night. Anyways, I'm gonna close out this vlog now. Thank you guys, and I love you. Bye.